Namaste. Welcome to this Monday morning Get Warmed Up session. Uh, today I'm going to share with you a warm up that we do in the bar class that I go to with Holly. And it's kind of my take on it. I'm sure it'll be exactly the same as her. Um, so uh, join me on your mat. You can do this if you're a chair yogi, uh, standing up, and if you're a mat yogi, on your mat. So we're going to start with just uh, limbering the neck first. So drawing the chin towards the chest, and then rolling the right ear towards the right shoulder, and chin back to chest, and left ear to left shoulder. And just going gently from side to side, Feeling your way in this. It's okay to make much smaller movements, particularly at the beginning of the day. Be guided by the responses in your body. And do what feels best for you in this moment. If you wish to, you can roll your head in full circles, but take care to concentrate on the space underneath the chin rather than taking the head behind the body. And if you're circling, which is by no means obligatory, circling three times in one direction. And then gently changing direction to circle three times in the opposite direction. If you're not circling, of course, just keep going side to side. And then the next time your chin comes to your chest, pause for a moment, have a gentle smile and bring your head back up to an upright position. Keeping the knees nice and soft, a nice wide stance, just rolling the elbows up and back. Allow your whole body to join in the movement. Nice big uh, circles with the elbows and the shoulders and the arms. Opening your chest as the elbows go back and down. Maybe just bending ever so slightly forward as they come forward. And just enjoying this nice, big, expressive movement. Again, doing what feels best to you. And you can take big, deep breaths as you do this. And then we'll do one more. And come to center, just reaching the right arm up and the left arm down, and then swapping to the other side. Gentle side stretching, letting the arms get involved, finding space underneath the, sh the armpits, underneath the arms themselves, down the sides of the body. Oh, lovely stretching. And here, be guided by your body. Just do as many as feels good to you. Keeping the legs active here, a little soft in the knees, a little lift in the belly, perhaps even have your buttocks a touch switched on. I'm gonna do one more to the right and then coming back to the center. Coming up onto your tiptoes, lifting your arms up over your head, up as high as you can. And here, just holding as you drop the shoulders down, feeling Everything engaged in the center of the body to keep you extended and lifted and balanced. And then dropping the heels down, letting the arms go, giving your arms a nice bit of a shake out. And then planting your feet for some squatting. Squatting you can do as gently or as shallowly as you like. And we're going to start with the hands in the center of the chest, drop the hips behind the heels, and then reach up as we lengthen the legs. So hands come always to that center chest position and then over the head, dropping the hips as low as you can, but keeping the weight in the heels. You can even take your toes off the floor. The idea is to keep the body nice and upright. If I do this upright, extended, the spine extended. If I do this from the side, you can maybe see a little bit better. So carrying on, doing a few of these. We're going to do two more like this. And then just keep the hands at the center of the chest and just press the hips forward 
when you come up to standing. And as I said, you can go in a much more gentle pace, or you can give it a bit of welly, but if you are going to drop down low, make sure that you're lifting your belly, that your weight is in your heels. Oh. We'll do two more like this, extending the hips forward and then dropping low and staying low for a little bounce. Roll the shoulders down, lift the belly, bounce in your lowest position that feels good to you. And then come up, give your arms and legs a shake out. And that's a great way to start your day. I hope that you've enjoyed this little warm up and you feel all energized from it. And now choose the yoga video of your choice and carry on. Namaste.